Let's take a look at a subfine sub fraction on a TI-34 multi-view. Specifically, we want to look at 20 over 24. Okay, we got this uh, this button here says N over D. If I push that, it puts a fraction symbol on there, and I can put a 20 in, down arrow, and I can put 24, and then right arrow, and then press Enter. Now you can press this simplify button right here, and what this will do is it'll simplify it. Now it won't simplify it completely, it'll start with your first prime, and um, then divide top and bottom by it. Now first prime that divides into both of them, I should say. So if I do the simplify, and then press enter, you see uh, 20 over 24 becomes 10 over 12. Uh, our first prime is 2, and they both were divisible by 2. 20 divided by 2 is 10, 24 divided by 2 is 12. Now it's not simplified form yet, so I can do my simplify again and press enter. And you see it says factor is equal to 2, and it does 5, 6. 10 divided by 2 is 5, 12 divided by 2 is 6. Now if you're wondering, well, is this simplified? If you did simplify again and press enter, it gives you the same answer. So when you get the same answer, that means you simplified as much as you can. Now it's not uh, restricted to um, any set number. For example, let me look at 300 over 600. Let me press clear to clear that display. And I'll do N over D. And let's put 300. And then, oh, down here I'll put in 600. Right arrow. And then um, I'll press enter to throw it into our memory. Though you could equally just immediately do the simplify. Okay, now let me do simplify and press enter. And my first prime, they're both visible by 2, so it divides the top part by 2, the bottom part by 2. I do simplify again, and press enter. And we get 75 over 150. Oops, got to press simplify again, and press enter. They're no longer divisible by 2, so went to the next prime, which is 3, and they're both divisible by 3. 75 divided by 3 is 25, 150 divided by 3 is 50. And then I'll press my simplify again, press enter, and we get 5 over 10. They're both, they were no longer divisible by 3 anymore, but they were divisible by 5. 25 divided by 5 is 5, 50 divided by 5 is 10. And I do simplify again, and press enter. And uh, they're both divisible by 5 again. 5 divided by 5 is 1, 10 divided by 5 is 2. So our answer is 1 half. Um, it'd be nice if it saw immediately they're both divisible by 300 and save the save press and simplify over and over. But uh, that's how you'd use that that method right there. Okay, let's go back to our original problem. 20, 20 divided by 24. Instead of using our fraction here, um, let's do 20 and then um, divided by 24 and press enter. Well, we got a decimal, and um, so I want to change that decimal to a fraction. And uh, you see above the ND, there's an F, and then arrows, and then D. If I do second, and then the N over D button, it puts that on my display. And then if I press Enter, see how it gives us 5, 6. So you think, okay, fantastic. I now have a, a, this option allows me to simplify it completely. But let's take a look at 300 over 600. If I do 300 divided by 600 and press enter gives me 0.5 and I think okay well I just need to change that to a fraction and I'll be fine so I do second n over d and press enter 5 over 10 it didn't simplify it uh, all the way down which is a little bit disappointing on that regard um, but you can press your simplify here and then press enter and it gives you your one half now um, Again, that's that's where you, you're putting it just into like normal division, and then you're changing that to to a fraction form. Now, if I have initially, if I do my n over d, and I got 20, and then I'll down arrow, put 24. Okay, so I got this, and if I want to convert it to a decimal, if I do second n over d, and press enter, it gives us this. And then, um, if I again want to change that to back to a fraction, then you do second n over d and press enter. Notice it does not give you your original fraction. 
um, gives us five over six. So don't think that the um, option allows you to to convert it exactly back the way it was. You may see some simplification done on it. But anyway, that shows you some uh, some methods to simplify a fraction on TI34 multi-view.